What is going on guys? Back with another video. We're here today to do a bit of a showcase. Showcasing Janimba. Now I have Janimba pretty invested into the dupe system as you can see. Uh, pretty high HP stat, attack stat, and also defense. And if you notice, I went with the critical hit route with him. Um, I gave him a little bit of additional attack, not much. Uh, and I gave him, well he has a standard five level 5 dodge. Uh, couldn't really do anything about that. He just gets it as an intelligence type. Um, he has a little 15 critical. Now you might ask, why did I go with critical on Janimba? And why didn't I do dodge? Because if I did dodge, I could have got him to level 20, right? Uh, the way I look at it is that Janimba is made to take hits, okay? Like he's already taking hits in the double digit damage. He's taking super tax for like 7, 8, 9k. Depending on the boss, if the boss hits hard enough, it could be about 15k, but he's made to mitigate all damage from all types. It doesn't matter where it comes from. He will mitigate damage, okay? So if I gave him dodge, he'll be dodging attacks in the double digits and four digits. It's, um, like it's not really a big deal. So I'm like, okay, well, why not try to make him hit a little bit harder? Because Janima can actually hit pretty hard with his dupe system modifications. Uh, he's one of the units that gets the biggest dupe system on boost because I think he gets a flat out 7,000 HP attack and defense boost uh, if he's maxed out in the dupe system. So his attack stat I think can peak at about 15k. Uh, plus he gets an additional 5k on top of that from his passive um, and of course when the uh, when the 120 on intelligence extreme leader comes out way down the line I mean, I'm talking like wow that's probably like a year from now whenever it's not even released on uh, the JP version yet but when that uh, extreme 120% leader comes out he is going to actually be able to like crit in the millions I'm telling you so a little bit of a showcase um, you know, he, he's very good, guys. He gets very good. So I'm trying to find a Buhan friend. I don't care about Buhan having anything to do, since I just want to have a Buhan friend. And uh, that's team. Let's get into it. So I'm doing this event because there's not really any other events that I can really test him out on. And I actually need to get Janima medals to awaken the LR androids. So, like I said, guys, hope you guys enjoy the showcase. And hopefully we can get some critical hits from Janimba. And uh, I actually tested out before, and I actually got a critical hit for about uh, 700k. Yeah, 700k from friggin' Janimba. You believe that? Did you ever believe that Janimba can hit anything that's worth? Oh my god. So like I said, you know, uh, we all kind of have our preferences on how we want to go about increasing the abilities of, of our units. You know, like, I see people giving um, Broly additional attacks and criticals and whatnot. I might have done something else, I don't even know, but, like, you know, it's not really a big deal. It's your unit, you can do whatever you want. Uh, you can give Blue Vegito dodge, you can give Blue Vegito crits. It's whatever you want, guys. So... We're going to see if giving critical hits to, Jan to uh, Janimba is worth. And uh, hopefully we can activate a couple crits. Hopefully we can get a couple crits in this video here. Um, okay, Janimba's in the next rotation, so we're going to have to definitely wait. And uh, I have no choice but to get a super with Buhan, so that's going to happen. Uh, I should have went for the orange orbs, but it doesn't really matter to be honest. I mean, this this is the first stage. It's not like, it's not anything difficult. You're just going to have to blow past this. Uh, I might do another state depending on how fast I get through this uh, because the point is to uh, showcase Janimba critical hits. I don't really care about beating the event fast or anything. Uh, ooh, Buhan, you almost saw uh, one shot. Almost, but didn't. Uh, can Android 13 come in clutch? Uh, he can. Wow, okay. And uh, let's go. So, can we get a critical hit right off the bat? I don't even know, guys. <laughs> Janimba's has to be like, I want to say top three of my favorite cards in the entire game. Top three, yes. My favorite is probably uh, Blue Vegito, and uh, then Buhan, and then Janimba. I want to say that uh, that's probably my uh, favorite right there. So, I'm uh, going to do that to bring on Red Orbs for Buhan. Yes. And uh, even if we don't get a critical, we can just see how he hits just as is without a critical hit. Um, so, Janimba here, pretty high attack stat. You know, not bad at all. And, uh, wow, we got the critical. Oh, my God. <laughs> 700 in 21k critical hit from Janimba wow you can't tell me that's not worth you're not gonna look at me and tell me that that's not worth and this guy is only 45% dupe system imagine him completely maxed out in dupe system <laughs> in that 120% lead yo <laughs> he's gonna be critting in the millions he will be critting in the millions guys so it's not a waste okay I mean like I said he mitigates all damage he will tank anything, you know, like normal damage, he's going to tank for double digits, uh, super tax, four digits, depending on the type of disadvantage, he might take, you know, super tax for the 20k, 25k, 30k, maybe, depending on the boss, uh, but for the most part, wow, okay, finish it up, 
Uh, for the most part, you know, um, I don't really see the point in giving him dodge because, like I said, he can be a hard hitter. Like you just saw, he critical hit for 700k. <laughs> so, I think it's worth. Uh, let's actually do one more event. Uh, and at the same time, I mean, there's nothing wrong giving Janima dodge. Nothing wrong at all, like I said. Giving your uh, unit's individual uh, abilities kind of depends on you and what you want. Uh, I kind of want Janim to hit harder, which is what he's doing. So I achieved my goal. Uh, but if you want him to tank better, you know, give him dodge. He'll definitely dodge super attacks every now and then. It can happen. So it's all individual, guys. I mean, no one is really right or wrong. Um, well, if you give Super Vegito dodge, then that is pretty stupid. So that's actually pretty wrong right there. But, you know, whatever. You can do whatever you want with your unit. So it's actually... Um, Let's do the uh, tech. We have the advantage here, so A, so this is actually going to be pretty fun. Now, if we get a critical hit on the tech phase here with Janimba, we might actually hit in the millions. Oh my god, that's going to be disgusting. Uh, I just want a Buhan friend of SSA 10. He doesn't have to be SSA, he doesn't need to be awakened. Please, please, pl 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 wow. Uh, we're going to try one more time in front of again, then I'm just going to do it off camera because I don't want to be here all day. Scroll in. And uh, I'm going to be here all scroll. I'm, yeah, it's just, okay. I'm going to find this uh, friend, guys, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. So I literally sat here for like five minutes, refreshing, refreshing, refreshing. I could not find an Awakened Buhan anywhere. So we're actually going to be bringing the Bulma item. Um, so we can add the 20% on top of the non-Awakened Buhan's um, leadership ability. So it will still be the same 140% uh, uh, combined leadership ability with the Bulma medal, or the Bulma item, sorry guys. So, uh, I'm probably going to aim for the middle. Yeah, let's actually go for Nappa. Let's do it guys. Uh, or should I go for the, nah, we're going to go for Nappa. Uh, yeah, we're going to go for Nappa. I think that's more worth. Um, now you can do this once a day, all types, which is actually pretty cool. Uh, we have Janim in the first slot, but we actually... I uh, don't have fierce battle, so that's gonna suck. So Janima is gonna be losing 15% attack up because there's no fierce battle here. But oh well, uh, we'll get a good idea what's going on. Um, yeah. So popping this 20% up, so at least he's gonna have his leadership ability buff at least. And uh, let's see what he can do here. So can he get a critical hit? That that actually be pretty clutch if he gets a critical hit here. Oh my god. Uh, that might actually do disgusting levels of damage. So we're actually gonna see what he can do. With the type advantage. Um, okay, so of course they're gonna tank. And uh, okay. Um, let's see what's gonna happen here. And uh, is he gonna critical? Uh, that was a lot less than I expected. Why? Oh, first battle. Okay. <laughs> wow. So you see a different first battle makes that 15% buff. Wow. Because he hit harder fighting himself. Oh my god. First battle, man. That's actually. I was like, what? First battle, guys. It makes a big difference, but as you can see, not bad. And uh, he got it twice in a row. We only attacked two times with Jinima in this video, and he actually got a critical hit twice, so not bad at all. I'll take it. Oh man, so definitely got to make sure that he's linked with a uh, fierce battle partner to really get a 15% buff because it is quite substantial, as you just saw. We have the type advantage, and yet he didn't hit as hard uh, as when we went against uh, Jinima in the actual event. Pretty nice, pretty nice, pretty freaking amazing right there. I'll take all those orbs, thank you. Uh, so as you can see guys, it's pretty much the end of the video here. I'm just going to uh, finish up the map here and then we're going to get the video out of the way guys. But I just want to kind of showcase your Nimba. I'll probably do a second showcase once I complete maximum, but I need two more dupes to do that. But uh, yeah, he's 45% maxed out and I could probably still get uh, some ways in the map as well. So probably have him at about 55% at the end of it all before I get the other two dupes. So yes guys, so hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, just a quick showcase for uh, Janimba, and uh, pretty good unit, pretty uh, decent as well. Yeah, so hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Please like, share, comment down below. I'll see you in another video. Thanks once again. Bye-bye.